Hello lovely friends, I'm Shay, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video we are going to talk about one of the biggest questions in learning English. How I never forget new words in English. People always tell me that they forget new words soon after they learn them. I think it's normal, we are not robots, we are not dictionaries, we are not computers, but there are some techniques we can use so we don't forget the words easily. First and foremost, you need a vocabulary notebook. This is a must. In this notebook, you are going to write down each vocabulary you learn per day. First technique is called spaced repetition. What is that? It means to repeat the words in different periods of time. For this technique, you need three highlighters in three different colors. For example, pink, yellow, and green. Here is how it works. When you learn a vocabulary, you write it down in your notebook. And if the vocabulary is hard, you just highlight it in pink. If it is medium hard, you highlight it in yellow. And if it is somehow easy for you, you just highlight it in green. What are these colors? What do they mean? If the vocabulary is highlighted in pink, it means that you have to repeat it after one day. If the vocabulary is highlighted in yellow, it means you have to repeat it after one week. And if the vocabulary is highlighted in green, it means you have to repeat it after one month. After one month repeating these words, you can remember them more easily. Next technique is doing puzzles. It is a hobby and also a good way of learning English. You can do puzzles, you can do crosswords, and there are some games uh, that you have to find an object in a very messy picture. I don't know the name actually, but what did it call this? These games also help you to repeat the vocabulary so you don't forget them. Next technique is telling stories. In this way, you put all the words you have learned in a context. Context is always the key. For example, today it was raining cats and dogs. I was on a bus, I was on my way to work, I heard someone shouting. The man was arguing with someone, he was really aggressive. Next technique is related to a hard question. How can I learn English from movies and music? Okay, this is a fun way of learning English and it's my favorite also, but on one condition. For music, you have to sing along with the singer. I know some of us may feel embarrassed when singing in front of people and this kind of thing, but we all do sing in the shower. Try not to deny it. And try to repeat the grammatical structures and phrases you hear in the song. I sometimes use some phrases and grammatical structures, then I realize, wow, okay, I remember from this song. I have used a grammatical structure or a phrase from a song without thinking about it, so it really helps. And about movies. I always suggest English learners to watch the movies with subtitles or without subtitles. But if you want to learn the vocabulary, it is better to watch them with subtitles. And about the last step, you have to give a summary about what you watched. You can write it down or you can tell someone about it. Now here are some tips to learn and remember new words in English. Try not to translate it. Instead, describe it. Always connect the words with a situation, with a scene from a movie, with a person. For example, if you want to learn vocabulary aggressive, try to remember someone around you, a family member or a friend who is aggressive. Aggressive. Or, for example, on your way to work, try to learn vocabulary related to shops. For example, butchery, bakery, bookstore, shopping mall or you are watching TV and eating ice cream. Try to learn different flavors in English. Sweet, sour, salty, bitter, and so on. Just make it interactive, connect it to your real life. It works really better. And please keep it in mind that language learning is a lifelong process. So please do not stop learning vocabulary.